Hey everybody, it's Dean. Hey, I thought I'd show a little bit about lighting a character. Something I've just kind of learned in myself, but I thought I would share what I learned. So, I got a Paragon or Aurora. That's how you say her name. Um, and I just put some rec lights around her in a triangle shape. Uh, Intensity is real low. And attenuation radius set re especially low. So it doesn't reflect on the ground. Uh, try to get down here so you can see where the bottom of the capsule is. Uh, it's basically just barely gets around the bottom of her feet. And, and the only other real big, well, there's a couple settings. Let's just get one of the frames here. Is I doubled the size of the inner square here. Uh, of the rec light. So it would be a little bigger around the character. And... Then also made the barn door length, which are these boxes here, longer. So I think, you know, it only shows up in two-dimensional shape, but I think those actually angle in like a, more like a cone on the character. And it gives a kind of a smoother or softer light around the character. And since there's three of them in a triangle around, it does a pretty good job. And then there's one last setting is you want to set their specular lights uh, from one down to zero. That way the frame itself, the light itself, doesn't get reflected in reflective surfaces like windows or mirrors. They don't show up. Uh, it might diffuse the light a little bit, but you can always adjust the intensity. All right, so let's see what it looks like in game. Uh, play. So I've got similar around my character, uh, maybe a couple extra lights and a little higher intensity. Uh, so the main character looks lit. Uh, you can see faces and so forth. So I got like one, I angled up on the front and angled down on the back. Uh, just wanted a little better look for the main character. Um, but for the, these characters here, yeah, I just figured some, a simple triangle and does the trick uh, for the skeleton at least the merchant has it has those uh, light panels um, he's also got a missive uh, material I didn't do that for the Aurora because she has 16 materials uh, but the merchant also has lighting around and then we'll go over to where these guys are wandering around uh, they don't attack me because I changed my player tag to demo so otherwise these are enemy AI and they are they look good uh, that zing sound is every time one spawns they make that sound but uh, once there's like 15 of them I think is how many I have set for this um, but otherwise looks good let's pause and eject and we'll give ourselves a little, a little better look on one of these cows. So this one's a mage. She, uh, actually, no, she's a swordsman. Uh, that lighting just really looks good. It's not very intense. I think I've got it at like a 150 or something. It defaults like 5,000. Uh, but these are also really close to the character. Uh, anyways, I thought I'd show this off. Looks really good. It kind of looks like moonlight. Uh, with this soft lighting, but it also at night here. I mean, you can see it's really dark here. They look good. The emissive on the skeletons. And the rec lighting on the characters. That's all for this video. Thanks for watching.